Hi, my name is Cameron Adam and you're joining me at Dalmahoy Golf and Country Club. Now, prior to working for Bunkered, I was a PGA professional for just over five years. So what I would like to do is share some of the experiences I've had as a coach and hopefully that will help you improve your own golf game. Now, today we're looking at the draw shot, so how to move the ball from right to left. We'll go down on the range, I'll give you the information that you need to hit that shot and I can also give you a drill that you can use when you're practicing and you'll be drawing the ball in no time. But before we get to that, if you like this video, please hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, we've got loads of great content coming your way soon. Okay, so what exactly is a draw shot? We're looking to start the ball right of our intended target, it's going to move from right to left and it's going to land on our target anything further left than that and we're in hook territory you know you just need a couple of things for this drill i've got an alignment stick here but you can also use a golf club if you want that'll be absolutely fine this is going to be pointing at our target i've got two tees that are going to go on the right hand side of this alignment stick one here and one slightly further right than that and this one is going to go in behind our golf ball So the red alignment stick is going to represent our ball to target line. Now simply put, that is where we're aiming. So in this case, I'm aiming at the flag up on the 18th green. This tee furthest to the right here, and this tee at the back is going to represent our club path. So that's the direction that the club is taking through impact. And this tee here is going to represent our club face, where our club face is aiming at impact. So if you want to draw the golf ball, you need to swing the golf club on an in to out path. Now an easier way to remember that is a right-handed golfer at impact, you want to be swinging that golf club to the right. This third tee here is going to represent where our club face is pointing in relation to that path. So if we want to move the ball from right to left, the club face needs to be pointing slightly left or closed of that swing path. At address, we want that club face to be pointing slightly right of our alignment stick. That's just going to ensure that we get the ball starting to the right. If we nail everything else, we should see that lovely draw shape that we're looking for. And there we go. Slight right to left movement, exactly what we're looking for, right on target. Now I'm actually a natural fader of the golf ball, which means I do the complete opposite of this. I'm used to swinging from out to in or to the left at impact. So I find this drill is just a nice little reminder of what it is that I need to do in order to get that right to left shape that I'm looking for. Now let's head out to the golf course and we'll see if we can hit this shot when it really matters. So we're out in the west course, we're on the 8th tee, it's a 435 yard par 4, slight dog leg from right to left, so it's absolutely ideal for that draw shot that we're looking to hit. Now we're basically going to go through and do the exact same thing we've just done on the range, but a little tip for you, when you're hitting a draw shot off the tee, tee up to the left hand side. I just feel like it takes the left side of the course out of play for me, if I miss it to the right I shouldn't be in too much trouble from there. Okay, so as I say, Exact same thing, point that face slightly to the right of our target and then we're just going to swing that club to the right. And there we go, just a slight turnover from right to left, I might be in the semi rough but it opens up the green nicely up there, not a problem. So we've jumped over to the east course now, we're on the 15th fairway and I think this shot sets up perfectly for a draw. Now as you can see the flag is tucked away on the left hand side but I don't really want to go at the flag because there is a bunker at the front of the green. If I end up in that I could short side myself, be a really difficult up and down for par. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to aim out to that right hand side of the green, I'm going to try and draw it back to the flag but I've got so much room there if I do miss it to the right it should be absolutely fine. Might have quite a long putt but I can two putt it, make my four and move on. Now we've got one five eight, I've pulled an eight iron here. The wind is slightly off the left, so it might make the shot a little bit more difficult, but the exact same things apply. I'm gonna point that face slightly out to the right hand side of the green, and all I'm gonna do from there is focus on swinging the club to the right. Hopefully I see that nice little draw that we've been working on. So as you can see, I didn't quite manage to turn it over from right to left as much as I wanted to. I've got about 30 feet from my birdie. It's a half decent chance. If I miss it, two putts, I'll make my par and I'll move on. And the main thing was, I managed to avoid this bunker. This is why it's a great thing to have the draw shot in your arsenal. You can take some of the trouble out of play, but you can still be aggressive and attack those pins. Now you've got all the information that you need in order to hit that draw shot. You've got a fantastic drill that you can use next time you're on the range practicing. Let me know how you get on. If you start moving that golf ball from right to left, then that is absolutely fantastic. 
If you are still struggling though, don't be afraid to go and check in with your local Club Pro. They should be able to give you some more guidance. If you've got any questions about the content in this video, leave them in the comment section. I'll answer them for you as soon as I can. If you've enjoyed the video, smash that like button. Please subscribe and we'll see you next time.